Hello all, this is D Swank, and I'm coming to you before I actually do my intro to this video. Why? Because this video is incredibly dull visually. And also a lot of other. I questioned whether or not I actually wanted to publish this video, but considering the fat other issues that I mentioned in my proper intro, um, I miss, I, I, there will be a huge gap between the previous episode and this one on just work that had been done on the station. So I kind of want to go ahead and publish this, despite the fact that the video elements of it suck. But anyway, uh, here we go, and I'm sorry that it's going to be somewhat boring. Yay. Hello all, this is D Swank, and I am back in Space Engineers, and well, I've done some work away uh, from the uh, camera. Actually, I recorded it and accidentally deleted it when I was freeing <gasps> up render space on my computer, so I did some stupid things and are having to do uh, some other video stuff, but this is the base that I have been working on. I think m you saw most of it taking form in the last video. Because um, I, I had started to throw down the uh, this catwalk, or not catwalk, but uh, footprint here, uh, it was actually to right here, and I had to extend it, um, down here I've got, got a sorting system set up, where, okay, yeah, over here is where, um, components go, this, is raw resources. This one is where uh, um, no, this is where ingots go, I'm sorry. Uh, components go this way. And then up here I, well, there's the refinery areas. I dug down below when I was doing all this and put yield mods on all of those. I have an assembler line here with speed mods. I have cargo containers which were giving me fits last time because every time I'd start mining off this way they'd start taking damage. So hopefully they don't do that again And yeah, so I'm planning on putting glass covering a lot of these things and stuff. But what I'm working on over here is my reactor room. And I've got a few floating bits that I'm going to have to deal with on that. And I need to put lights on the uh, station because it is dark. But I do want to get the reactors up fairly soon because I am running out of uh, well I'm running out of resources and I need to take the, sh the little ship here uh, out to gather some resources and So I'm 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 gonna try and get the reactor up so I can actually go out and not fear about this all getting deleted by cleanup. Then I can start sealing off segments and things like that. And it'll be good. I need 
need some steel plates. Hopefully I can dig this all out and I've done well enough that my uh, cargo container over there won't be damaged. I th don't think it's fair that mining here will damage those cargo containers. I don't uh, think that that's the way the game should work. I don't think it's the way it's intended to work. So, if they do get damaged, I'm going to go in and do some creative tools to fix that. Because I don't, th I don't think that's the way it's supposed to work out. Okay, yeah, I am doing the right drill. I was afraid I was drilling incorrectly here for a second. Don't need a whole lot of stone yet. But yeah, my, my plan is to get, well, to retrofit my little, uh, the, uh, the ship out here. The, uh, this, this only is going to be here for a few more sessions, hopefully. I, I hope to build a new proper mining ship that can dock and do things. So my goal in this episode and I probably should have announced this earlier, considering I'm halfway done, is to get the room done. Not necessarily the uh, reactors in, or even placed, but the uh, just the square of the room. So even if I edit it out, and it's slow and oh god okay did I get both of them yeah I did uh, okay you there we go well I needed a block there anyway all right so there is three we've we're Halfway through this wall. Let's clear this out some more. Pop that, pop that, that, and then we got this mess to clean out. I need to clear this out a little before I can Alright, that should be nice and clear
It's looking good. Alright. I mean, all that stone is going to have to go away anyway. Just wasn't as level as I'd hoped that drilling run was going to be. At this point, I'm kind of hoping that I'm going far enough back for all uh, ten, no, seven blocks. I doubt it. But. Alright, so, one, two, three, uh, I might be, actually. That is irritating. Just how long you have to wait to place a block there. amount of stone that I'm having to dig out. Why? Why can't I have a better drill? Only because I just haven't gotten off my butt and queued one up. I bet I have the stuff to make one. I kinda think I should go and make one. But also part of me is like, I need to get reactors up. I could do a cheap reactor, but why? Since I, I can go ahead and do this now. Okay, I'm all upside down. Okay, there we go. I'll need to go and clean that up. Can't put one there yet. Okay, can I now? Yes. We should as this progresses be able to turn pretty dang soon. Yeah, I'm not that far from the petrosite, but it's not going to make it into the... Alright. I'm hoping... that I'll be able to dig... because this is the... the corner. The vertical corner tower piece here. So 
So, I mean, if I just keep digging this way... I should pop out. There we go. Hello. I'm home. So let me kind of open this a little bit. Open all this back up. Pop you. Pop that. Pop that. Right. that. Alright. Just keep popping all this. Pop all the stones. I am getting all turned around. I'm going to have to go and get more Oompa juice pretty soon. But I kind of want to get this corner here done. So, zoom, 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 back in here, get some oxygen, not oxygen, but power, then go and So we've got four more squares to go this way. 
actually, I don't know how many more squares this way. But I do know at least three. I don't know if I'm going to have it turn or if that's going to be a wall or what. But I know it will go at least three squares. If I'll do rooms behind it, a hallway behind it, or what, I do not know yet. Almost two. And I'm actually pretty freaking close to being uh, done with this. I am incredibly excited about that. Well, bare minimum, it should be four, but I'm just going to go three because I can come back and do the rest. I don't know whether it's going to be an open floor plan back the rest of the way or what, but. slowed down for a second. And in case y'all hadn't uh, seen during my uh, live stream when uh, Crunch messaged me, he will soon be returning to the tub of yubs. There we go. I like this. I like this a lot. this this is turning out pretty good and this part's gonna be super easy so um, wrapping up thoughts for this episode because it was pretty much just carving out the reactor room next episode is going to be plumbing the reactor in, uh, putting the reactors where I want to put them, um, so that's going to be all sorts of fun, um, don't know what's going in here, but at least that's one I can do and make as messy as I want, sort of. All I really need to do is make sure I put in a couple of uh, uh, waypoints so I know which way I'm going or what I'm trying to do. So. Um, like I said, this episode was just getting going to be getting the room set up which I'm pretty close to being done with. Next one is actually putting stuff in the room. Show, let's see.
This is actually the easy part. Right here laying the blocks down. The next part is not going to be particularly easy. do need to get the ceiling across too, so we'll work on that real quick. This last little bit's going really fast. Yeah, I'm all turned around again. And actually, because of the way voxels work in this, I could technically separate this whole voxel set and be fine. I don't really want to. I kind of want to keep it all part of the roid. Just because I think that's going to be enjoyable and interesting. But... I also got gots to work in all the detail stuff for the reactor. Which is gonna be somewhat difficult. Alright. Let's throw you in. Alright. Boom, boom. Can I not? There we go. Oh, another death voxel. Yeah, I may have to just go back through here and clean this up. Some for, like, uh, with voxel hands. Get rid of this. Okay, that one went away. Good lord, that was a lot of stone in one voxel. to clean. This is getting tedious, but I'm almost there. I think it'll be worth the episode. Getting this... If it, if it looks the way I envision it in my head, I think it's going to be awesome. And I think it's going to be well worth all the effort. Yay. Wants energy now. Yay. Alright. I'll have to clean that up a little bit. But there we go. The area around, I can travel all the way around, yay. So, now that that's done, I need to do a tad bit of cleanup around here. Because all this is going to be sealed behind glass. Honestly, the middle shouldn't be the fattest area. So I need to do some land sculpting here, or asteroid sculpting, on the, uh, the center part. But I'm going to end this episode here. I've got an hour that I'm going to edit 
granted it's kind of dull. Um, I did just dig and place blocks and run around and grab oxygen and not a whole lot else. I kind of ran out of stuff to talk about because there's only so much ho home it looks like rain. I'm digging a hole you can talk about. Um, but I think if this ends up the way I'm hoping, it'll be worth it. I think this will be one of my better looking reactor areas. Ooh, that did not work out quite well. I mean, it's... I'm kind of just roughing this out, so I don't know... Alright, that's... other than this, which I got lagged on. I think, let's thin this back a little. Thin this lat back a little. Right here. This is get looking better. Let's pop that. Work it back into the rock face. Some um, same here. But I think, yeah, I think I've got this. I don't really want to stop because I'm in the zone, but, uh, yeah, um, I'm going to end this episode, pick up the next one right after this, uh, with my goal of getting the reactors in, built up, plumbed up, and hopefully everything will be working. Alright. That actually looks pretty good. So, until next time, bye bye